Hello everyone, today we're going to be talking about some budget options for hard drives. You're probably thinking, um, like, how, how is this, is this a, it's a bad idea to get budget hard drives because you can have issues with all your data and it's like, so it's like the most important part, the build or something, or most people say the CPU is, but I mean, if it's coming to all your data, you kind of don't want to lose that. So today we're going to be talking about some budget options and some downsides to the budget options. So first we're going to start out with this Wedger, West, Western Digital. This is the budget option. This is not the budget option. Um, Western Digitals are a pretty good pick if you want to go cheap. Um, the only downside i got to say is their lifespan is not the best thing out there. I do have one in one of my personal rigs I built. And it works out fine. It's pretty fast. It's great. Uh, don't get mad at me if I said pretty fast. Um, it's a 500 gigabyte. I don't recommend getting one terabyte if they even sell one terabyte editions. Um, I've seen some friends that use these things and had some of them break down. But uh, other than that, pretty good. If you have some money to spend and you want something more trustworthy, I recommend a Seagate. But you guys can have other opinions. You may think, I don't know, some Wolf or Iron Wolf or whatever they call them. Brand. I, I don't know what that brand's called again. I forgot, but it, they're pretty good. And also them that one brand. You know, I don't know the hard drive brands. I don't really care about that stuff. But, um, so if you guys ever want a budget option, Western Digital is a pretty good pick. Just remember, it could have problems in the future that you cannot fix or you get the point and also they're a little chunky like this one is only a 320 gigabyte and look how much thicker it is look how thick this thing is compared to this 500 you may think it's 500 gigabytes it's always gonna be bigger it should be two times it um no that's wrong it shouldn't i've seen one terabytes as big as 500 gigabyte so yeah but um, I guess that's the end of the video, and I'll see you guys in the next one.